concept of unit circle friends let us see the important concept of trigonometric function that is unit circle this is a unit circle you know why this is called a unit circle the word unit means one if radius of circle is one unit then it is called as unit circle let point o be the origin with the coordinates 0 comma 0 and the radius be one unit now consider this as x axis and this as y axis consider this point on x axis so its y coordinate is 0 and its radius is 1 the x coordinate is 1 now this point is on negative x axis so its coordinates are minus 1 comma 0 as radius is 1 now can i say on the y axis x coordinate is 0 and y coordinate is 1 as this distance is 1 unit that is its radius along negative y axis the coordinates of this point is 0 comma minus 1 now always remember this first number always stands for cos of angle and this one stands for sine of the angle so always first coordinate is cos and the second coordinate is sine of the angle similarly this is cos this is sine this is cos sine this is cos sine got it great now let us start from this point it is 0 degrees so this one is 90 degrees this is 180 degrees this is 270 degrees and again after reaching the initial point it is 360 degrees these values are in degrees in radians we can write it as 0 and superscript small c this means radians remember pi radians is equal to 180 degrees as reference value so 90 degrees is 180 degrees upon 2 that equals to 90 degrees that is 90 degrees means pi upon 2 radians now 180 degrees is pi radians for 270 degrees it is 3 pi upon 2 radians and again 360 degrees is 2 pi radians so on the positive x axis we have 1 comma 0 in degrees so 0 degrees comma 360 degrees and in radians we have 0 radians and 2 pi radians friends please by heart this concept you must have also learned this in school but let us repeat see this we write this in the respective quadrants all s t c the best way to remember this is all students take coffee all s t c now all means in the first quadrant all the ratios are positive so a in second quadrant s is for sine so sine and cosec are positive in third quadrant t means tan so tan and cot are positive and in fourth quadrant c means cos so cos and sec are positive so we have all students take coffee a s t c